Good morning, it's Wednesday and we're on the Willoway Dock. Let's take a walk through the dock and look at some great plant shipping out today. First off, we have uh, vanilla strawberry, hydrangea paniculata trees. As you can see here, big, huge, beautiful flowers and a lot of buds. So we got some great looking plants shipping on hydrangea, vanilla strawberry. Favorite on the dock here, we're looking at our three gallon and this is uh, Spirea Little Princess. And you can see bud and bloom on these beauties, they look very nice. Another favorite, this is uh, Spirea Neon Flash. A palette of our three gallon nest spruce, as you can see here, really nice value, tipping 15. Here we have another hydrangea tree, and this one is Quick Fire. So, um, as you can see, we have blooms now and blooms coming. We have a lot of buds on these. These are one of the first to bloom. But you can see here, very nice blooms coming up on them. Very nice full heads. This is quick fire. Tree a palette to show you our three gallon double knockout roses. And um, look at the buds on these. They're just coming out. They got that great uh, red new foliage on it. Just loaded with buds. They're gonna color up. Just starting to crack color now. Looking at our crop of seven gallon Pieris, and these are red mill. And uh, look at this beautiful full plant. It's got that uh, tinge of new growth come on here that's gonna lighten up and give it that nice red tinge to it. So uh, these are gorgeous plants, seven gallon pure spray. pulled a few azaleas to show you the size on these. And here we're looking at uh, Cascade and Karen Azalea. Nice full three gallons, gorgeous. Here's another nice color plant. We're looking at our three gallon uh, old gold junipers. And you can see these are nice, big, beefy, uh, heavy 15 to 18 inch, three gallon old gold junipers. You can see the bees buzzing on these. Uh, Three gallon spireas here, the gorgeous full color. These are uh, three gallon double play gold. Look at that nice full plant, uh, great foliage color, and bud and bloom. Double play gold. Hold one of these grasses to show you the three gallon. This is a proven winter selection of grass called Cheyenne Sky. And you can see these nice big full three gallons. And as the season progresses, they'll get that nice burgundy tint to the foliage. Very nice plants. Cheyenne Scott. You can see the nice bud and bloom on these uh, Crocosmia. And here we have Lucifer and the orange pico tea. Um, you can see they're nice, heavy bud and bloom plants. Coming down here, we have some color on the, the Plumbago. And look at the buds on these. This is uh, Mr. Good Bud. And this is an award winner. Nice 19 centimeter plants, heavily budded. They're going to perform wonderfully. They love the heat gonna give you a lot of color. Then we're coming up here, daylilies are hot on the dock. Uh, these are the twice as nice as you can see here, nice big full plants, a lot of color. We see these almost every week and for good reason. Look at these 15 gallon emerald green arborvitae. I mean these are just gorgeous big full plants. You can see full to the base, nice value. These gorgeous plumes on these uh, Penicetum hamlins. These are 19 centimeters, big full grass as you can see, gorgeous plumes. We also have an outstanding crop of threes available. Be sure to check out our grasses. See how popular the Cheyenne skies are on the dock today. And then I'll swing over here. Uh, we have a lot of nice clematis. We have the Raymond Evanson series still showing some color. And then this one will start to uh, show some color soon. This is a fall blooming uh, clematis paniculata. Here's another nice summer color plant. Uh, it's our three gallon. This is uh, Cretinus and this is Royal Purple. You can see these are big, beautiful threes. Pulled one of these 19 centimeter grasses off to show you. This is Carl Forrester. Exceptional value on these. This is a hot landscape plant. And wow, look at these 19 centimeters. We're looking at our three gallon sea green junipers. And you can see nice tight habit on these threes. Gorgeous full tight plants, three gallon sea greens. And I'll swing over here to show you. These are our two gallon Physocarpus tiny wine. Look at that gorgeous full plant. This one's got great foliage color and summer flower and a nice compact habit. Tiny one. And some hosta. We got a great selection of hosta, but I wanted to show you an up close look at that plumbago. Uh, full, gorgeous full plants, and you can see they're bud and bloom. Look at these seven gallon Syringa Miss Kims. Uh, nice full landscape plants. You see a nice consistency to the crop. Gorgeous. Seven gallon Miss Kim. Here I'm showing you our seven gallon uh, Acer Garnet. And this is a dissectum uh, maple you can see here. Nice full tight head to it. Good value. Budley is looking great right now and uh, I just wanted to show you the bud and bloom on these uh, blue chip juniors. And you can see here they're just coming out to show some color. 
gorgeous plants, full, fragrant, and heavily budded. This is Budlia Blue Chip Junior. We got some wagons coming up to the dock here. Let's take a peek. We got more of those gorgeous double knockouts. And here we see bud and bloom. These are pink. And wow, look at these drifts. Gorgeous full plants. A lot of buds on these. These are pink drift. We've seen the threes, and here you see a pallet of twos. And these are the two gallon double knockouts. Look how gorgeous and full those are. They're loaded with blooms and that really um, burgundy. They have some two gallon knockouts, and uh, you can see all the buds standing up on them. I pulled one of those off to show you how nice and full they are. They got that burgundy foliage loaded with flowers, just starting to crack color. Two gallon knockout. Here we have a pallet on this wagon, a three gallon blushing knockout, and you can see nice, tight, compact habit. A lot of buds coming out on them. Um, they were trimmed up to give you this nice shape, but look at the buds coming out. Bud and bloom, blushing knockout, three gallons. Here we have uh, three gallon Ramnus fine lines. Again, some more wagons coming up here. These are all full of uh, endless summer hydrangeas. You can see the nice consistency to that pull. Let's pull one of these off and take a look. So here I'm coming down to show you the nice full consistency of these plants. And you can see they got buds on them. They're coming out of that trim. Buds just showing to come and flowers starting to show color. These are our three gallon endless summer. Earlier in the video you've seen the seven gallon uh, paniculata trees and here we're looking at a 15. So you can see these have quite a bit uh, larger head and they're just starting to come out uh, showing some color. Heavily budded, nice full trees, 15 gallon limelight. More of those uh, very pretty uh, little princess. You can see the buds on those. A lot of nice uh, color there. Here we're looking at our three gallon blue star juniper. And then look at these repeat blooming daylilies. They are just loaded with uh, color. We have purple Dior here. We have some pardon me. And then I'll swing over here. Look at these happy returns. Gorgeous full plants. Here's another bright color plant. This is Anna Ball Thuja. Nice, tight, compact, a lot of color. Good form on those. Now, wow, look at these. These are a popular plant from the Plants at Work group. This is Thuja Fire Chief. And uh, this heat has brought on a lot of nice color. It's bringing out the, the great attributes of the, the color on this one. This is Thuja. As I told you here, we have a lot of nice hosta coming up. On the dock here, we have stained glass is just uh, outstanding uh, value here in this order, but I got a chance to show you an up close look at these uh, Budley, uh, lo and behold, Blue Chip Junior. Look at the flower power on these. More very nice three gallon grasses. This is Redhead in a three gallon. Very nice, full, uh, heavy plants. They're just starting to throw some flower spike up to them. Three gallon very popular perennials here. We're looking at uh, the bud and bloom on our 19 centimeter uh, Roseanne geranium. Uh, gorgeous plant. This one looks like it's going on a landscape job here. And look at these steel blue uh, foliage on these blue fest. The plants that I'm looking at here is Caryopteris. This one happens to be in the first editions collection. Uh, this one is Sapphire Surf. And uh, these have nice tight buds in them. You can see heavy, full, good value on these twos. And uh, the buds are there. They're starting to come in. You'll see them down in there. They're going to color up in the next week or so here. So get your Caryopteris in. And next to them is a proven winner selection. Here we're looking at Petite Blue. Blue here is a proven winner selection. Uh, and it stays a nice low tight compact habit and has that deep cobalt blue flower to it. Petite Blue Caryopteris. Take a look at our three gallon on the summer and you can see here these are coming out of a trim. Beautiful flush of growth. Just starting to throw buds up. Here we have our two gallon endless summer. And I showed you these um, garden flocks a few weeks back but we'll give you another peek at them because garden flocks is going to be at their prime. Of course we have the candy store series and this is another new one from uh, plants that work called the unique series and uh, here we're looking at Cherise and pink and uh, we'll come in here you can see all the buds on these very heavily budded nice color. Here we have Allium Medusa and this has very unique twisted foliage to it and they're just loaded with flower buds. You can see they're just starting to open up here. Look at all those buds on these. This is a very heat tolerant plant. Gorgeous color. Here's another look at those seven gallon limelights. I just can't point out enough that these are going to start to show a lot of color here. 
heavily budded. The buds are just starting to open up. This is a great time to get these. Here we have a block of Syringa Ivory Silk. And as you can see, these are pretty big uh, 8 to 10 footers here that we had in our quick turn program. So be sure to check out that availability because we have some specimen B&B that we can put right on your container load. Really nice value are these uh, three gallon Alberta spruce. And you can see here nice, tight, compact plants. Good value on the size of these. And they got that poof of new growth coming on them. Outstanding, three gallon Alberta spruce. <laughs> Look at those two gallon double knockout roses. You can see here, loaded with flower, very nice full plants. Then we'll come up here, this is landscape ready here. We have uh, seven gallon Ramnus fine lines. Look at the flower power here. We got Rutabecchia Goldstrom. And uh, you can see here, nice full plant loaded with flower. These are really gonna light up the summer here with a lot of color, Rutabecchia. Echinaceas, we got a great selection of echinaceas coming out now, bud and bloom, uh, sensational. If you're doing a job, check out these Hicksai. Here we have our five gallon Texas Hicksai. They just flushed out in some growth. Look at that, exceptional value. We're looking at our three gallon, this is Buxus Winter Gem. Nice full heavy 12 to 15 inch plant. Here we have a popular re-blooming uh, day lily. This is Stella Dior. And you can see these uh, 19 centimeter plants are very full. Nice uh, fan divisions here, loaded with flower. These are on sale too, we got a great value on these, so if you're doing a landscape job, this would be the time to get them. 19 centimeter Stella Dior Daily. I showed you these sedums on and off uh, throughout the season, and uh, this is an exceptional series called the Sun Sparkler series. And uh, this is one of the newer ones, this is Sidoro uh, Blue Elf, and it's a new hybrid. As you can see here, it's got great silver foliage. And we'll zoom in there, and all those little spots are buds. So very shortly here, even with this heat, they love the heat. You can see they're going to open up and give a lot of nice color. This is a real hot one. This is Sidoro Blue Elf. Here's a close-up look at that um, stained glass uh, hosta that I was telling you about earlier. Look at these gorgeous 19 centimeters. Really nice uh, golden green variegation to it. Clean foliage, heavy plants. Steam glass. Here's another look at those uh, pardon me uh, day lilies and you can see look at all the bud and bloom on these very nice full 19 centimeters a lot of nice fans good bud set. This uh, rhododendron has been on the dock all season long and it's a very adaptable plant with the Encahara rootstock it's tolerant to different soils and pHs and uh, it's got a really nice hot pink color to it this is Incaharo Lakeview Pink. Look at these beautiful three gallon plants. Here we have one of my favorite barberries. These are two gallon. This is a Sunjoy Gold Pillar of Maria. Um, it's a proven winter plant. Upright selection of yellow and uh, gives that bright sunny uh, foliage to, throughout the summer. Here's another bright sunny yellow plant here. We're looking at our uh, three gallon mop cypress. Very nice full plant. Very popular Wajilla here. We have uh, Wajilla Spilled Wine. Gorgeous threes. I wanted to pull some of these seven gallons off here. I'm looking at a seven gallon burning bush. Big, full, heavy plant. Look at this beauty. Well, that's a quick walk through the dock. We looked at some great perennials, shrubs, trees. We got a lot of great looking plant material out to give you a blast of summer color. Be sure to check with our sales team and I hope we're loading a truck for you.